Levin Camacho is a member of the We Are Guahan Coalition. He is also an attorney who works at a local law firm. He has spent a lot of time poring over the final EIS and has paid special attention to DOD's selection of Pocket as a firing range. Well, one of the things we found is that it's not really uh, one firing range. The firing range that's supposed to be near Pocket actually consists of five different ranges. There's a rifle range, a pistol range, a machine gun slash grenade launcher range, a non-standard firearm, small firearm range, and a, I believe a mortar range. Um, so they're going to put five ranges up there, which is why they need so much property. In fact, according to the FEIS, the range is actually referred to as a range complex because it will consist of five firing ranges in one big complex. So why not just put it all on base? DOD currently has firing ranges at Arodi Point, the Nick Tams area, and even Taragi Beach. They actually admit that they can put four out of five of the ranges at three places within DOD property. Taragi being one of them, um, I believe Arodi Point also being one of them. DOD did first look at staying within its footprint and Rather than break up the five ranges or see whether or not they could accommodate all five at different spots, they said, no, we have to put all these together. And so one of the questions that we have, again, is why didn't they split up the ranges? One of the reasons given by DOD and the FEIS is that splitting up the ranges would cause extra traffic. But the FEIS also admits that four of the ranges can be put on Anderson at Taragi Beach. Then the remaining one could be put at the Northwest Field. If they were to build four of the ranges at Taragi and one of the ranges at um, Northwest Field, that's a straight shot from, from NCS up to Anderson. And again, those are relatively close to one another, so they can transport troops back and forth without a whole lot of traffic and not any traffic on public roads. So what other reasons did DOD give then for selecting Pogget? Well, according to Volume 2, page 62 of the FEIS, the sites along the west coast of Guam were eliminated following advice of the Office of the Governor.